I want to start with Gautam Gambhir first because as this uh, visit unfolded of the Delhi Chief Minister at the Ghazipur landslide, I, I remember that uh, job we met that we shot with you, Gautam, at uh, this particular land uh, fill site, and you'd said that things would get much better. Now, the Aam Admi Party seems to be suggesting that things are getting worse, and this is the responsibility of the MCD, which is run by the BJP. And on your watch, Delhi is being turned into a mega dustbin, and you're not being able to deal with it. Gautam Gambhir. Yeah, it has got worse, but it has got worse for Aam Admi Party because the landfill, with my absolute honesty and integrity, I can say that, it, that the landfill has come down 40 to 50 feet. And you're such a big national channel, you've got such a huge crew. Please go send, send the crew to landfill and see how, how it's happening and what, what's happening there. With the intervention of our Prime Minister, Honorable Prime Minister, with the effort of the Lieutenant Governor, there are 20 formal machines which are working day and night. And as I just mentioned it to you, so it has come down 20, 40 to 50 feet. And you can see from the naked eye as well. The most unfortunate thing is, so the team of Delhi, who, who was there for the last seven years, has not even visited these landfills, even once. And today, when it has come down, even the MCD election around the corner, he wants to try and politicize this matter. In 2020, I wrote a letter to him requesting him that he should go there collectively and work towards making the life of the people living around there much better. No reaction, no support from any quarter. Eventually, the lieutenant governor took up the responsibility and has been able to get the land filled down. And They're saying that channel, this is the MCD's responsibility, this is the BJP's responsibility, and therefore at this moment the AAP can't do anything about it. When they win, if and when they win in MCD, they think or they claim that they'll be able to fix this royal mess. As I just mentioned it to you, that it has come down 40 to 50 feet, and this has not happened since the last 15 years. This landfill has been there for the last 40 years. And isn't it the collective responsibility of all of us? Why politicize everything? We are all elected representatives. The CM of Delhi is the CM of the entire Delhi. How many times has he visited the landfill? How many times was he bothered about all these landfills? Only because now, because the MCD election is around the corner, we want to politicize this matter. Why did, why did he not come with me in 2020 when I wrote a letter requesting him to come and visit the landfill along, along with me so that we can work together and probably whatever support he can give and whatever support collectively, collectively we can work to get this landfill down. Not even a single reaction. What there. is the and specific we, help as the member of parliament in that area that you need or require from the state government which you think at this moment is not forthcoming, which could solve the problem of uh, this royal mess? Not anymore. When it, when it was needed, there was no support from it. When the lieutenant governor took up his responsibility, now there are 20 formal machines working day and night. It has already started coming down. And on your national channel, I can say this, that in the next three to four years, we, we will be able to finish off this entire landfill. And you, you can take it on record and probably play it and tell the people of Delhi. That's what I'm saying. Because when I have met the lieutenant governor, why he's only spoken about the landfill. And he's so committed to finishing off this landfill. Give us some time. I've only been there for the last three years. So the CM of Delhi has been there for the last seven years. Forget about the support. Tell me, wasn't it was his responsibility to go even one step? And if it was not his responsibility, why did he go there today? Just to polit politicize the matter. Why do you want to politicize everything and on every front? You're talking about what kind of a support do I want from the uh, state government? What has he done in the last seven years for these landfills? Has he even spoken about those? Has he even been there once? And forget about them talking about the landfills. I'm the only one who's converted all these garbage places into four community kitchens and one library. So they should be the last people talking about these landfills and their waste segregation. It is a shame when you politicize such important issues where there are thousands of lakhs of people living around that area. If he didn't want to politicize this, he should have come with me in 2020 because there were no elections during that time. He had no courtesy or even that emotion towards the people of Delhi that he could come and visit there with a member of the parliament. So imagine where Delhi is going to and where Aam Army Party is trying to criticize or probably politicize everything, which is literally a shame. Okay. I'd leave it there for the time being. Gautam Gambhir, you're in the middle of uh, cricket commentary and you found time to join us on the news track. I won't hold you back any longer. Uh, thank you very much for joining us and setting up this conversation. You're saying that things are indeed getting better, not getting worse. And you're also promising that in three years, you'll clear out the entire landfill site and we'll hold you to that, Gauti. Gautam? 
all I want from you people is just go there, send your crew there, and show the people of Delhi how the work is happening on that landfill. And whatever the truth is, please show to the people of Delhi because I have not gone into this politics to not say the truth. I want people to know the truth, and you have all of us together will be able to show the truth so that the people of Delhi can get to know how it is coming down and what all efforts are being made to get this landfill finished. Okay, I'd leave it over there. Thank you very much, Gautam Gambhir, for joining us.